I have just spent four days at a museum conference getting to play with museum personnel in all sorts of environments like the Children's Museum and uh, the Science Museum. But today we are having the last night party in the History Museum. Check out the party. And uh, several floors worth of fun stuff. How do we become Colorado? Zoom in on the history of the Centennial State through a hundred of the most significant, striking, and illuminating objects from Colorado's past. These objects tell the stories of people who have called this rectangular patch of plains, mountains, and mesas home for 13,000 years or more. Portals to our shared past, they connect us to the people who used and valued them and to the events that shaped their lives. Preserving our history is an act of sh shaping our future. The stories in this gallery reflect the ideas, achievements, and challenges that have defined us as Coloradans today. If we listen, they can help us decide who we want to become tomorrow. Uh, should that be whom? Being the wild Civil War buff that I am, I have to love the flag they have here from the Civil War. This is the battle flag of the 1st Regiment of Colorado Volunteers who beat back the invading Confederates who wanted Colorado lands for the gold. This one is in here for my friend Ross, who works for the fire department. The uh, Denver hats are fancy. Okay, this one's fun. The ceremonial railroad spike celebrated Colorado's new link to the rest of the nation. The long-awaited track from Denver connected to the transcontinental railroad line in Cheyenne on June 20th, 1870. Two days later, the citizens of Georgetown presented this spike to former Governor John Evans, president of the Denver Pacific Railroad. I have to show you guys the rest of the story. The actual silver spike never made it to the ceremony. The miners responsible for carrying it from Georgetown pawned it in Denver, drank away the proceeds, and slept through the ceremony. In its place, Evans waved a, continental, a conventional spike wrapped in white paper to pure silver. He later recovered the real silver spike from a pawn shop. Oh my God. This is one hell of a piece of furniture. Wow. And now we're in another one of my happy places. It's a crazy quilt. It's a huge crazy quilt. It's beautiful. What makes the story even better? This is the seamstress of it we have the ladies another soft spot in my heart bicycle history Aww. they have a ballot box here but this is from before they had women got the right to vote that wasn't until 1893 very much appreciate the fact that besides uh the um you know the white people history we have stuff about all the rest of the inhabitants of Colorado. The embroidery on this is to die for. <laughs> and more Colorado history. A mining pick. Okay, just saying. We've got this thing for the unsinkable Molly Brown to represent her. But um, she never went by Molly. Her name was Margaret. I suppose the unsinkable Margaret Brown just didn't roll off the tongue so well. Okay, gotta share this for the skiers out there. It's a ski lift from 1946. Next to a uh, war, uh, World War II era mountain division uniform designed in Colorado, of course. You've done this before. All right. We can go enter the mine. Can we go to you? Can we go down to the mine? You just close it tight. Okay. All right. Oh, my. The mine shaft here is kind of tight here, but. Woo. Oh. Whoa. Going down in the mine, y'all. 
Working in the coal mine, going down, 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 working in the coal mine. And coming out of the mine shaft, or down the elevator, into the mine. Okay, here's a fun bit of automobile history. The Fritchell from 1903 is a battery powered car. Oh my God. And check this out. You can just see through here. It's a battery powered car with a flower vase. Just a solid wall of dark, boiling, rolling, twisting clouds of dirt. A lot of them thought the world was coming to an end. We shut the door and bolted it just as a thing hit the front. We actually get to go inside. Okay, um, somebody from Denver is just going to have to explain this one to me. 